drop it. Hi guys, this is Story Time with your buddy Andrew. Okay. Most people don't know, but some people who watch my videos, like my sister, my mom, my grandma, dad, um, they know, um, I do good with needles, like, make sure they hurt, and I get, like, ow, and, like, E and stuff. This, no. I'm, like, a port, the line, this is, it's fine. So, one day, we went to the hospital, and I was supposed to get an MRI. They took my port out already, and... I had to get an IV. And that's the only thing I don't go good with. Always need someone to hold my hand. I don't know why, but IVs hurt more than shots, pick line, and a port. No idea why, but they're basically the same thing. So, um, the doctor put a little tight thing around my arm to push the blood down. Well, not blood because it, it's an IV, but whatever. And they give me a little squishy ball to squish so it makes my vein pop up. Not like out of my skin. No, no. Like, just so they can see it. So I squish the ball like this. So they, so my vein can pop up. So then, yeah, they found, they found my vein. So they go, went, went ahead and, um, stick the IV in and they wanted me to keep squeezing it but my but that little thing on my arm it felt like it was numb my whole arm was numb so I couldn't squeeze it and I like, keep squeezing it keep squeezing it keep squeezing it but I couldn't my arm felt numb and then like they poked it. Um, my dad saw something we were going on because I'm um, like, sure, I would almost cry with a pick line. Like, don't judge me. Like, sure, I, yeah, it does hurt. Like, um, cause one time I went to the doctor and like they poked me and like they said I did super good. There was this last guy who came in, and it was a guy. And he even cried. So, yeah. So, continue. Started crying. And my dad told me, does it hurt? And I'm like, yes. And then he told the doctors that it usually takes, like, like usually it gets in it and it's out. This time, um, it, 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 it was in for a very long time. And they were struggling with it. I don't know why, but they were struggling with the my vein. And as soon as you know it, I like I want to pass out at this time. At at this time, but like it's still I want to pass out really bad from how bad it hurts. But no, I don't pass out. Catch. Okay, I can't talk right here. This is gonna. Thanks for the loot, kid. I really wanna pass out really bad, but I don't. But I want to keep in mind. It felt like my arm, my whole arm. Okay. Here's an example. Yes, I am in my pajamas. People put the thing here because they get the stuff from here. But no, she puts it way up here. And I made my whole arm like go split. So I couldn't squeeze the ball a lot. Then once they put the IV in, there was blood in the tomb. They were draining my blood. They were draining my blood and the blood went into the tube. But nothing came out into the little disc where they get the blood to see if it's all right. 
and that's when you know she popped my vein. She, the doctor popped my vein, and they had to poke me again, which is not good. It's not good. People are like, oh, that's not that bad. Um, the truth is, it was like a doctor in training. So, um, she didn't know what she was doing. Like, she did, but half of the time she didn't know. And that's where I got my trophy of the day. This little guy. That little guy right there. This little guy. She popped my vein, and this was with me since Monday. Yes, you have heard it. Whoops. Monday. When you push on it, oh. when you push on it, it hurts. When you push on it, it hurts. It it hurts really bad. Not really bad, but it hurts. And like. I was like, I wanted to fall asleep right then and there from how bad it hurt and how hard my, how, how hard my, like, or not how hard, but like how numb the top of my arm was. And like, I wanted to disappear. I wanted to leave the hospital right then and there. It hurt super bad. I just wanted to quit my MRI and go home and go to sleep. But no, we had to go to the MRI and then I had to wake up and I had to go to the doctors to check my eyes. But they didn't delay. They weren't supposed to delay my eyes, but they did anyways. And I came back and all that stuff. Now, that's not part of the story. The story is when you get, like, like, if you go to get, um, like, an IV or, like, a blood test and they have to give you an IV, if it's short, okay, then they're, like, real doctors. But if it takes longer than that time it usually doesn't take, then they're, pro like, doctors in training. And, um, that's not good. That's good, like, they're trying to like work and stuff but like doctors in training like don't you work on like clay dummies or something that has fake everything like fake heart fake 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 veins like fake stuff no they actually work on people so if you ever have that problem in the hospital you know they're doctors in training or they don't know what they're doing at all my little my little prize from Monday inspired me to make this story time so see you in the next story bye